Goldie back again with another product review video. This time we're listing the top seven toys for nonverbal autism. This goes with a blog called Nonverbal Autism Toys by Age Group on getgoalie.com. If you're interested, we're going to drop a link in the description below. Go check it out. What is the first toy? So number seven in our list of toys for nonverbal autistic kids is the Simple Dimple. So what you do is you, you know, stim with it and you get to pop it. And it's really fun to use. It's really great for toddlers or even nonverbal autistic kids who are going to school and need a little fidget because it comes on a little carabiner so you can put it on your backpack and just kind of sting with it. Super fun. That's why it's number seven on our list. Number six is the fidget spinner. And I know we have traditional fidget spinners, but this one's kind of my favorite because it's chaotic. This is a great way to do play therapy with a nonverbal autistic kid. So this is called a galactic fidget spinner. What you do is you turn it on, you hit it. Hold on. <laughs> You hit it, I swear you do. Oh, and then it just kind of, whoa, it hovers. Anyway, it's great for kids at home who are nonverbal, who just want to have some fun and uh, exercise creativity and play therapy. It's fun to chase these around the house. Number five, Play-Doh. Play-Doh is great for anyone who's sensory seeking because you can mush it, you know, feel it. So it's really great for toddlers, but even all the way up to elementary school kids or teenagers. I still love playing with Play-Doh, I know that. It helps with creativity and play therapy, and it's especially good for nonverbal autistic kids because they can sit there and have their own time with their Play-Doh, exercising their sensory needs. Number four, weighted stuffed animals. So weighted stuffed animals are great for anyone, but especially nonverbal autistic kids who need a little bit of comfort. There are a lot of sizes and things you can choose from. Moon Cowls is a really great one. We uh, actually reviewed that a few months ago. We'll drop a link in the description below. But it's weighted and it hugs you. So it's like a great way to just calm down and help your kid with those sensory issues. Number three, Legos. So Legos, everyone knows what Legos are. Just don't step on them. <laughs> Legos are super fun to get out your creativity and it can be kind of like a parallel play thing where your autistic kid and another kid can play next to each other and feel really comfortable building and creating together. Number two, Minecraft. Minecraft is great because it helps your kid relax. It's, it's a very calming game and it still helps you build that creativity and it's a solo game. So they don't have a lot of pressure, you know, to interact with other people or other things. So it's a great way to spend their time and it helps with problem solving and a multitude of other things, which is why Minecraft is so great for nonverbal autistic kids. Number one, goalie. So we might be a little impartial, but our skill building tablet for kids is perfect for nonverbal autistic kids because we have a slew of apps that actually help with language development. So it's got an AAC talker, it's got Word Lab, which is a language learning app, and that helps them learn how to use their fingers for finger dexterity and to use their AAC talker. So it's perfect for nonverbal autistic kids of any age. Check us out at www.getgoalie.com to learn more about how our awesome tablet can help your kid who is nonverbal.